What's up guys? Today I'm in Bridgehampton, New York for an invite-only private concourse show called the Hamptons Concourse. So this show is put on by Bradford Rand and Rand Luxury. It's featuring tons of Ferraris as you can see. So we're gonna walk around the show and check out every single car here. So starting back here, we have my friend's Rosso Corsa Ferrari F8 Spider. He's been enjoying this one a lot lately. Next to that, we've got a 488 Spider, black on black. Another 488 Spider, this one white on black. This beautiful, like, metallic maroon red F12 Berlinetta. Take a look at this paint. This paint suits this car so well. It's so classy. We've got the tan leather interior, silver wheels, really beautiful spec. And then over here, we've got my friend's 488 piece to spider in pearl whites. If you remember from previous videos I've showed this car in, the headrests have 488 piece to spider embroidered on them. So that's cool. Loads of carbon, as you would expect. Full gray Alcantara dash and seats with black in the middle. And then we've got this black 488 spider with a really bright interior, full red leather, comfort seats. Man, that's bright. I like it. Look at those floor mats. The Scuderia shields on the floor mats, that's nice. And then behind that, we've got a black over like a beige leather interior F430. Manual, oh wow, this is special. You don't see manual Ferraris too often anymore. There are a few here, but I haven't checked them out yet. So this is the first manual Ferrari I've seen here today. Next to that, another 488 Spider, classic red over tan. Then we've got this 458 Spider. We've got two California Tees. This F8 Spider in red over red. Check out this interior. I love seeing the red interiors. This one has black in the middle of the seats. I love this like white leather striping on the sides of the seats. It's really nice. Next to the F8, we've got another 488 Spider. Behind this, we've got a 488 GTB in the $30,000 Giallo Triplo Strato paint. This one has exposed carbon fiber at the front, which is really nice to see, as well as carbon fiber center caps. And it looks like a really dark gray leather interior with blue seat belts and blue carpeting on the floors. It's really unique. No carbon on the interior, but I don't mind that. It gives it a classy look. Look at these like silver paddle shifters, the silver on the steering wheel, the silver on the F1 bridge in the middle. It's quite cool. Can't forget to mention this stunning blue over tan F12 Berlinetta next to the red over tan F12. Look at this. That's blue leather. It's a really dark blue. Then you've got blue accents on the tan leather seats. With silver wheels, this spec right here is perfection. I love this. These two specs look so good next to each other. And then we have my friend Ryan's F355 Spider. And this one is a manual. That's why he loves it so much. It's why it's so special to him. Look at the carbon fiber on the top of the shift knob. So nice, great condition. Alcantara steering wheel, that's cool. We've got this stunning car, 512TR. That is such a Hamptons car right there, especially in white. Next to the F355 is a 308 in black. And then we've got this 458 Italia. This one's interesting. It has exposed carbon on the side here. So not just the side skirts, but like this piece here. That's interesting. It has a stripe on it for some added flair. And this aftermarket titanium exhaust. Look how beautiful those blue exhaust tips are. They're like blue and purple. They look so good. I bet this car sounds amazing with that exhaust. We've got my friend's blue Tour de France 488 Spider with a red interior, carbon fiber racing seats, Daytona style with the blue accents. This Grigio Titanio 812 GTS. This car is so beautiful. 
789 horsepower from the naturally aspirated V12 engine. This is the ultimate Grand Tour. This is something you don't see too often or ever at all. A Ferrari 412 brought here from Autosport Designs in Huntington Station. We've got a California next to a 488 GTB with the carbon fiber spoiler. I've shown this car before. It's always nice to see. A 458 Spider, an F430. Let's take a look at the engine of this one. This one is so well maintained. So clean in there. Another rare car, the four-seater Ferrari Mondial. I don't even remember the last time I saw one of these. Another California T, an F8 Spider with an aftermarket vinyl stripe, a Testarossa, a 512 BB. Take a look at this interior. Another 512 BB, this 812 GTS with painted Scuderia shields, that's a $14,000 option. But believe it or not, that's a pretty popular option because this 812 GTS over here also has that option. It's got the gray metallic painted wheels, a red and black interior. I love this quilted stitching, just gorgeous. Here's a stunning dark red metallic 812 Superfast next to a 575M and my friend's new 488 Pista Spider. This spec is stunning. Take a look at the interior. This one is interesting because it has the Scuderia shields embroidered on the headrests. This is actually the only time I've seen this option. Loads of carbon, you got it here, there, at the front. The entire rear diffuser is carbon fiber. This is carbon as well. We've got this Giallo Modena SF90 Stradale, the 986 horsepower beast. Twin turbo V8 engine, three electric motors. This car has insane performance. This is the one with the tan interior, the racing seats with the red accents. It's an interesting spec. We've got a 360 Modena here, a 360 Spider over there, and this F430 over here with Scuderia style wheels and Scuderia style stripes, but this is not a Scuderia, just a regular F430. This A12 Superfast is painted not in Rosso Corsa, but in Rosso Scuderia, which is a much brighter red. Award. We've got the engine on display here, six and a half liter, naturally aspirated V12, all carbon in one. this engine bay. You've got the chassis number right there. It's really beautiful to see. You've got the paint sticker right there. So as you can see, Rosso Scuderia. This is a really highly optioned car, so take a look at the interior. It has blue leather and blue Alcantara with like these orange-red accents. Just look at the steering wheel. How crazy is that? Blue and red. So cool. Carbon everywhere, as you would expect. Every time I see this build, I'm just in awe. It's such a cool spec. This here is actually an option. The Italian flag badge for the back of the car. And I love that plate. Scuderia Ferrari, 1947, the year the company was founded. We've got yet another 458 Spider and an F355 Spider in blue Tour de France. This is John's car. Tan interior with like this baby blue stitching. It's really nice. A Ferrari Daytona. How often do you see one of those? I actually see this one quite often because he comes to the weekly Ferrari Club America Long Island meets. Most of these cars are actually owned by Ferrari Club of America Long Island members. So I've seen a lot of these cars before, including that SF90, this 812, and pretty much all these cars up front here. We've got this Ferrari 308 GT4 and a blue Scozia 458 Spider, tan interior blue stitching next to this Dino. Oh, Morgan just won the Best in Class Award for this 812 GTS over here, the blue Electrico one. Let's take a look at this before we continue on. Blue Electrico painted Scuderia shields and a white leather interior. So you've got white leather Daytona style racing seats and blue sterling on the steering wheel and on the dash and on the doors. And this one has the optional carbon fiber door panels. So this is an expensive build, but it came out so nice. So the owner actually wanted San Marino blue from BMW, but that would add at least 12 to 18 months to the build. So we just got blue electrico because it's a really similar color. It has like purple hues and certain lighting. 
and it's just stunning to look at. So he got blue Electrico and he's really happy with it. He was originally going to get a full blue leather interior, but it seemed a little too dark. So they got the white leather seats to make it pop and I think it came out amazing. So we've got the 812 GTS. We've got this Argento Nurburgring 488 okay, Pista with red and blue stripes. Next to a 430 Scuderia Emmanuel, 16M Spider. There's only 499 of these in the world. So it's very special to have yes, one here today. Have. Next to a Super America. Course, this car is like also really rare. We've got Long Island sports cars display here. The new Artera V6 Hybrid Supercar. 720S Coupe in Volcano Mr. Yellow. Aston Martin Racing Green DBS Superleggera and the DBX. This color drop dead gorgeous. This might be my favorite Aston Martin color of all time. Let's take a look at the window sticker. 371 is the total price of this build. That's the optional equipment. So this one's currently for sale at Long Island Sports Cars in Roslyn, New York. So we've got a nice British lineup here and then a bunch of Italian cars. Favorite we've got this Ferrari 330 here with a green a interior. Beautiful Ferraris we have. And so well kept. A Ferrari 308, the same car that was seen in the movie Magnum PI, hence the license plate. And this 250 GT PF Series 2 Cabriolet. We've got a nice display from another sponsor, Manhattan Motor Cars. So we've got a Neptune Blue Porsche Taycan next to a Bentley Continental GT Convertible and a Rancho Borales Lamborghini Urus. And, the uh, 641 horsepower super uh, SUV. Such a great family car, but it's also fast, so it's perfect for those supercar enthusiasts who happen to have families. And the new Rolls Royce Ghost. Wow, look at this. He's painting Carlos signs. Save the stick. You heard me. So, just. I can't forget to share this really fascinating build. A Rosso Dino Ferrari 458 Spider. So technically this color is red, but as you can tell it looks orange. I featured this color on my channel several times. But check out this interior gray and orange so you've got orange leather gray alcantara with orange stitching such a cool interior matte carbon fiber trim in the center and on the steering wheel so you've got orange and gray on the steering wheel wow this build made my jaw drop when i first saw it this morning when do you ever see four five eights in specs as wild as this one this piece back here is matte carbon fiber so nice. Got the carbon fiber center caps and these really nice diamond finish wheels. So I gotta give you guys more details on this 1999 Ferrari. So this is an F355 Spider. It's the Fiorano. It's the last Ferrari model that was individually numbered. So you'll see on the interior, there's a plaque that says 92 out of 100. So officially Ferrari made 100 of these cars. Unofficially, they made 104 cars. But yeah, this is the last Ferrari model with individually numbered cars. So now, like with cars like the 458 Speciale, they're all just one of 499. They're not individually numbered, but this car is. And there's two of these cars here. So this one's number 92. And this black one, Ryan's car, is number 46 of 100. In Valley. Got some Brent. delicious looking pizza here. Valley, Pepperoni Rome, pizza with it. some Italian yeah, supercars. It's a great day so far Rest here at Hamptons Concourse. And, and look at this, we've got the Icon A5. This thing moves in the air and on water. It's really cool. I believe this is about $300,000. So my question for you is, would you rather have this or something like a fully loaded Roma? This is a great venue. You can see some beautiful Hamptons homes in the distance like that one there. And then there's one right here. This is Hamptons Living at its finest. Got the pool house, the beautiful pool, the lawn chairs, a sport court, and probably like a 6,000 square foot home. Gorgeous, I love the Hamptons homes.
thank you to Bradford Rand for putting on this event and allowing me to attend it and show you guys what it's like. I'm very grateful that I got to come to the show and share it with you guys. The pizza was delicious, the cars were great, and with that, this video is over. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.